because I loved you. Like I wanted yeah. to, I wanted to break down this religious structure that you guys have created. That was never in my intention. I have to destroy it. You know, I have to break it down. So now we can boldly come before the throne of grace, you know? Mm. So now like we can, I channel, I channel the Holy spirit. I channel yeah. the father's heart. Father, what are you doing? What would you say to them? Father, yeah. tell them I love them. Tell them I die for them. Tell them that I'm going to make all things new. Tell them that yeah. this it's not over, that they still have hope. Tell them. And he's like, this relationship you were talking about hearing his voice, that's channeling. Yeah. Well, people are doing that with disembodied spirits. They're doing that with elementals. You know, they're doing it with all kind of other things. And it really is a slap in the face. And the Lord warned us, don't consult mediums. Don't consult. Why, see, why seek the dead on the behalf of the living? Like, yep. you can go straight to the, they dead. They had their chance. They're not yeah. here anymore. They're on the other side. You know, quit trying to go to them for secrets. They're, yeah. they're lying, disembodied spirits. And so, you know, we can go directly to the Father. And if you go to the Father and he sends an angel, he sends a messenger, I'm, I'm cool with it. But you got to make sure you're going directly to the Father for that stuff. Don't, yeah. go, don't try to open up a portal or go. Because any other gate that you enter in through, you're a liar and a thief is what the scripture says. And if, yeah. our, if we're going through the narrow gate, um, because there is a there is a uh, there's a lifestyle, there is a uh, integrity that you must walk in if you're going to be dance on in both realms. You know what I'm yeah. saying? If you're going to be casting out demons, if you're going to be helping people work through trauma, these they, you become a target. You get a target or you cast out a demon out of somebody, you get a target on your back. So if you ain't done the inner work, if you ain't walking with Christ, your days are numbered, Jack. Yeah. I'm tell I'm not playing. I get under the anointing talking about this, you know, <laughs> and uh, I ain't playing. I got experience with this. <laughs> yeah, they don't no, play sure. fair. They ain't yeah. like us. They yeah. don't play fair. We think it's a even playing ground. Everyone has their turn. No, they want your yeah. soul, bro. They yep. want to know what it feels like to possess a human being, bro. They want to yep. know what food tastes like again. They got to have a host. They want to know yep. what chicken tastes like. Well, guess what? They got to have a body. Let them possess a body. They can use you and control you and influence you. And they want to know what, you know, chronic masturbation feels like. They want to know what rape feels like. They got to have a body. They got to have a host. Yep. Come on, man. You yep. better protect your neck out here. Come yep. on, man. Amen. Take, you got to. If you enjoyed listening to this podcast segment, be sure to listen to the entire episode by clicking the video to your right. Also, we are on iTunes. You can download the MP3 versions as well. Be sure to subscribe for future episodes.